Have you been seeing someone recently? Yeah. Are you seeing a girl? Uh... <laughs> so as you know, I have a YouTube channel and it's kind of successful, but it's only successful when everyone shows up to film and my mom has been avoiding me lately. She doesn't answer my calls, she doesn't show up for filming, she doesn't answer her texts. I think something's up and I'm gonna get to the bottom of it. So I got my sisters together to see what the f is going on. I haven't heard from mom in a while. I have no idea what she's doing. She talks to me every day, clearly I'm the favorite. You need the emotional support, that's why. I don't need any emotional support. So what's mom doing then? Hanging out with her friends, partying every single goddamn day. She's dealing meth. She's yeah. dealing white claws at this point. Do you see what she gave Devorah for her housewarming gift? Yeah. A pack of white claw. All she does is roller skate and drink. She has a bad influence around her. You gotta tell us who it is. I think she's trying to be young. She wants to be young, so she's trying to hang out with the young kids. I can see her watching this and going, I am young. <laughs> <laughs> no offense, mom. <laughs> I think she forgets that I'm her child. <laughs> yeah, swear. Jen never treats me like a kid anymore. <laughs> start calling her mommy and see what happens. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you should do that, Corey. <laughs> We're gonna FaceTime my mom to see what she's up to right now. I can just imagine the next bit. So my sisters weren't very much help, so, so I decided to get on a FaceTime call with my mom to get to the bottom of it. Yeah, that's what you sound like, Brennan. Fuck you. Fuck you. <laughs> What's up, Brat? What's going on? Why haven't I heard from you in quite a long time? What have you been up to? Oh, she's silent. Do you remember your daughters? Huh? Do you what not care that? about us anymore? You remember us with all that drinking that you've been doing? <laughs> Look, she has a white claw in her hand right now. Mom, it's yeah. 2. It's 2 p.m. It's tangerine juice. She's losing it now that we're all gone. <laughs> I'm totally fine. Do we need to move back in? No. <laughs> No, as a matter of fact, I want my keys back. Excuse, Excuse me? Excuse me? Yeah, just in case, like... You're not getting your f***ing key Why back. Why the f*** would we give you our house key back? Yeah, here. mom. Oh my god, she's literally what losing I it. I don't give a f***. <laughs> this video needs to be, my mom is having a midlife crisis. <laughs> Someone please help her. I need to meet your friends. I need to see what they're like. I need to make sure they're not doing drugs or drinking. That's all they do. I'm worried about you. I'm happy. I'm very happy. We'll get to the bottom of this, Jen, one way or another. The bottom of what? I'm happy, so and that's all that matters. I think you miss your kids. I always miss my kids. I love my kids. I think that you don't want kids anymore. <laughs> You want to come over and drink a White Claw with me? No, no. I don't want to drink a fucking White Claw. I will literally put holes in all of your White Claws and stomp on them in the backyard. <laughs> this obviously isn't working. She's being vague and she's making the conversation about drinking again. Either way, I'm going to find out what's going on. There's nothing going on. No, I have to go somewhere. We're going to perform an exorcism on you. There's a spirit, Can you certify? There's a spirit of a 20-year-old college girl inside of you and we need to get her out. She has a I'm seance to perform. Let her go. Go hang out with your friends. <laughs> Because you don't care about your daughters anymore. That's not true. I care about you guys very much, and you know I love all of you. Whatever. Whatever. Even even you, Corey. Why do you say even me? What the f does that mean? Okay, mom, go do your thing. We'll be in touch. Have fun. It's fine. You have fun She's too. just an actress that we hired to play our mom. <laughs> <laughs> if I want to learn the secret to what's going on, I'm gonna have to go to the biggest blabber mouth in the group. You guys know who it is. Devorah got a new apartment. Oh, yeah. Congratulations. I'm a homeowner in an apartment complex. Ooh, a renter. <laughs> so you're starting an OnlyFans now to help pay for this? No, I can't. Some supplemental income. The thought is in my mind, but I don't think I can do it. I can help you if you want. I, I know you you've offered your services. I appreciate it. I don't know what to do here. I feel like we're, I'm not. Corey, get out. We're going to take some OnlyFans <laughs> photos. You can come back in like 30 Sorry, minutes. Sorry, right. Come back later. All right. So my mom has been avoiding me recently, and I have a feeling she's up to some weird shit. She has a lot of friends. That's all I know. Friends. Whoever she hangs with, obviously she doesn't want you to know. Why? That's a good question. I don't know. Why don't you ask her yourself? I'm kind of sketched out. Yeah, what do you know that we don't know? Nothing. Why do you keep smirking? Like she's that? working with another YouTuber. Of course that's what you would think of. Right, and I wouldn't worry about that. They would kick her off, like, immediately. Yeah, that's true. I can barely <laughs> deal with her. What if she's be, a like, white deal claws on set? No. Why do you care so much? Why are you being so nosy? I need to get my mom back in videos. People like her. She <laughs> has her life, too. Like, she can hang out with who she wants and not have to tell you. You're being nosy. She doesn't have a job. You're being nosy. Mom has no job. How's she making money? <laughs> what is she doing? <laughs> I don't money. know. All I'm gonna say is it's not my place to share. I'm not a blabbermouth. I can keep secrets. Like, I didn't tell about the time Claudia got <laughs> Oh, fuck. <laughs> Give us a hint. Mmm, young. That's a given. I already know that. <laughs> that, that wasn't actually much of a surprise. She's just hanging around people that give her some good vibes and good energy. That's all I know. Like, she's vibing right now, hardcore. And I can't tell you who with because that's not my place. So, good luck finding out because I don't think she's going to tell you. So, my mom is a straight up drug dealer. That's what I got it from Devora. She hangs out with people who have good vibes. I'm not fing stupid. I know good vibes mean crack cocaine. I'm just looking out for her. What's she's doing for? just fine. Is she? Yes, she's just fine. She's doing great, actually. She's drinking every day. What can we do 
for you to tell us what's going on. Hmm. Give you a thousand dollars. Yeah. <laughs> We just talked about this. We don't have a budget for this. We can't give away money. I forgot. Oh, give me a housewarming gift. This was her housewarming gift to me. White claws. White claws. Wow. Yes. I'm gonna get you a plunger for your housewarming gift. I actually need one of those. <laughs> now that I think about it, I didn't even think about a plunger, but I never. You should clock the toilet one. last night. I never really, really, really used one. one. <laughs> I don't think I've ever used one. What a blessed Seriously. life to never use a plunger. Well, now I'm gonna. <laughs> Corey needs it every time he takes a shit. I'm gonna jinx it. Now I'm gonna like be fucking clogging the toilet. <laughs> Game time is over. It is time for a good old fashioned stakeout. You see my face? No, I, I can't see you. You're too, too undercover. Dude, I've been here for like four hours. She hasn't left yet. What's the game plan? I'm just gonna wait until she comes out. And then what? We're gonna trail her, see Wait. where she's going. Why? She's been going somewhere doing some weird shit. She might be like Walter White selling meth. That would explain a lot. I honestly it. still don't know how my mom makes money to afford this house. <laughs> <laughs> so they, it could be true. Dude, I don't like the, doing this kind of shit. It's stressful. I don't think she's gonna be able to recognize us. You've never parked here before, right in front of the house. <laughs> in the same car she's used to see. She won't be able to tell. She's oblivious. Are you parked next to her car? What the f dude? Dude, there's no other spots. Stay low. <laughs> she's out, she's out, she's out, she's out. Just don't move. If you don't move, she can't see you. What are you doing here? Hmm? What are you two doing? Are you high? No, not today. You guys are so fucking weird. She has no idea what's going on. I told you. I really do not know what Brandon and Nick were doing, but I'm so used to their weird shit that I was just like, whatever. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, come on, move out, move out, move out. Here, let me back up so she can't see me. <laughs> okay, she's going, she's going. I'm gonna lose her. She's oblivious. Oh, God, she's going to the drive thru. I don't know who else it could have been. Stay low, stay low, stay low. We're in a blind spot right now. She can't see us. Is she giving us the finger? Well, she's giving it to this fucking fence. I don't know who else it could be. Where's she going now? God, she's quick. She's real fucking quick, man. There's no way she can tell that this is your car following her. She can't see that far, she's old. You think she's going to make drugs? To make drugs? Yeah. She's a drug dealer, I know it. Is she trying to lose us? Yeah. Stakeout time, boy. She has no idea. Just stay discreet. Got her in clear sight. Fuck, I think she's walking to us, dude. Just, just stay low. I'll turn the car off. What are you doing? Why are you following me everywhere? What do you mean? What are you up to? I'm selling drugs. It <laughs> looks like you're selling drugs. Are you making meth? No, I'm not making meth. You promise? Mm -hmm. Why have you been ignoring me? I've been busy. Doing what? Stuff. Like what? Things. Hmm? I've just been busy. With who? People, my friends. Friends? Yes, my friends. <laughs> I want to give you a lie detector test. You don't even have a lie detector test. How'd you even see us? Brandon, I know what your car is. I bought this with you. We should use a different car. No shit. Oh my god. Okay. This isn't a laughing matter, actually. Yeah, I need you to come to the house later. Why? Because we have some questions to ask you. You gotta come tonight shit. at 8 p.m. We have no idea what the f you've been doing or where you've been. You could be a drug dealer, you could be a prostitute for all I know. Is it meth? This family is meth? up. Jen, are you making meth? Making something way better than that. I kind of oh. want to try it. <laughs> <laughs> Mama Jen's meth. <laughs> all right, 8 p.m. tonight, Jen. 8 p.m. Well, you're getting interrogated. Ooh, I'm so scared. And stop stalking us. It's weird. Oh, look who showed up. Are you ready for your uh, lie detector test? <laughs> Jen, you got some splaining to do. Why? You've been gone lately, not telling anyone where you were. Oh, she's avoiding. I always tell people where I am. Is it a white call right now? <laughs> white calls, Nick. They're not whiskey. You know where we got this from? Some old man on eBay. It's ridiculous. Okay, so my original plan was to get my mom to confess to being a drug mule, but I recently discovered some very important information. I just got a call from my manager, Allie, saying that my mom is in handcuffs with another girl. I heard that you were handcuffed. To, 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 okay, first of all, I heard that, that you were handcuffed to somebody recently. No, that story got very blown out of proportion. <laughs> no, Allie yeah, called me. Allie, Allie called me. Very different than no, you Allie said. called me and was like, she "Your mom is handcuffed, handcuffed to another girl." She said that you said that you were handcuffed to her. And no, she does not listen. 
<laughs> she comes over to me and she says, oh, Jen, is there a key? And she's handcuffed to herself. She's got her arms handcuffed, her wrists. And I looked at her and I knew you guys couldn't find the key the other day, so I was like, no. Okay, so this wasn't a sexual thing. No. Thank God. Yeah, Allie, Allie made it out to be a sexual thing. No. Which was weird. Are you serious? <laughs> That's what she said. Me and Allie have to have a talk. <laughs> <laughs> I specifically told her it was platonic and it's not what it seems like. No matter what I said, it doesn't matter. It sounded bad. Thank God we found the key though and got her out of it because I thought we were going to have to take her to the fucking precinct and get it cut off. <laughs> oh, cut her arm off? No. The Handcuffs. I kind of like her arm where it is. Yeah, you do. I didn't try to cut Corey's <laughs> arm. Cut. <laughs> you want to get her on the phone to confirm the story? Allie? Oh yeah, call Allie. So when I called you about the handcuffs, how the f did it get to the story that we handcuffed each other together? You were, said you were handcuffed to her. No, I said she handcuffed herself. That's not how I interpreted it. <laughs> what do you mean? You either hear it or you don't. Okay, so she may or may not be a drug dealer, but now I know that she's seeing somebody. So I'm gonna get to the bottom of this one way or another. Okay, so this is the way it's gonna work. If we catch you in a lie, you get paid. Stop doing that! <laughs> I'm sorry, no, I'm leaving. <laughs> no. It's, it's I don't like that. Well, there has to be some kind of consequence, otherwise you're not gonna take it seriously. I'm gonna get strapped up, Mama Jan. Nick, um, I need you to tase my mom if she lies. All right, Nick, you got it, fam. you don't fucking touch me. <laughs> what would you do if I tased you, Josh? Kick you in the nuts until they don't show anymore. <laughs> they're inside of you. Oh my God. <laughs> See how these are moving? If you lie, I'll know. I'm nervous for this one. Nick, you can sit over there, grab you're the taser. You're nervous for this one? Yeah, I'm, I'm nervous. Why? So I'm not even I don't know nervous. if I want to know the truth. I no, don't thing. think you're supposed to drink alcohol during this test, by the well, way. That's not really considered alcohol. You're going to completely skew the results. That is not considered alcohol. Okay, first I'm going to ask you some baseline questions to make sure it's working. Okay, mom, is your name Mama Jen? No. She's lying. How do you know? Is, your name is Mama Jen. This is the test. <laughs> <laughs> it just blobbed a bunch of ink. What does that mean? It means you're really lying. <laughs> what year were you born? 1968. Just telling the truth. How do you know? Because I'm reading the waves. How about that big blob right there? Why the pump stop working? Look at that shit. <laughs> <laughs> Mom, are you and dad divorced? <laughs> yes, thank God. How many parties did you go to in the last week? I don't know if you would consider them parties. Look at this movement. There's nothing, Brandon. You're getting... <laughs> You're getting a little bit nervous. Why is that not working right? Is it really broken? No. You, you ought to take this back to that old man you're, and you're lying. hit it over his head. <laughs> Get your <laughs> money back. <laughs> Have you been seeing someone recently? Yeah. I've been seeing a lot of people recently. You have to be more specific. I see Devorah. How many? I see you. I see Claudia. I see Nick and Corey. This is what I have to deal with. You think I'm the crazy one for resorting to a fucking stakeout and lie detectors? I'm not fucking crazy. I'm normal. Totally normal. How many dates have you went on in the last week? None. I don't go on dates. Have you been seeing one person? Yeah. Are you seeing a girl? Uh, <laughs> yeah. Is she your girlfriend? I don't label things because then you chase people away when you label them. What does that even mean? Fuck this text. Like the word girlfriend. Look, mom, you're lying. <laughs> I'm gonna find the old man who sold me this on eBay. <laughs> what, kneecap? Pro probably do nothing to him. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck do these knobs do? None of them do anything. <laughs> Look. Meanwhile, when we were setting this up, Brandon's like, don't touch the knobs. I have this perfectly calibrated. <laughs> we literally spent $1,000 on this. All right, Brandon, bring out, bring out the hard guns. That's insane, Brandon. You okay, mom. No, don't, don't, don't do that. Are you dating a girl? This works so much better than the lie detector <laughs> test. I'm not dating though, I don't think. I don't think it's a lady. I'm seeing someone consistently as of right now, like once a week or something. Well, I guess we got you to admit it. What? That's why you haven't been in videos recently? You've been hanging what out with someone? What do you mean? Someone? I have you been, been in avoiding videos. Us? I've been in every single video you've wanted me to be in. Fool. Yes, she has. <laughs> Jen, yeah. what's, your, what's your truth? What, what, are, what are we getting out of this? Brandon wants to know if I've been seeing a girl. And? Yeah. Oh my god! Oh my god! So this relationship is fun, new, and exciting, and it just goes to show that you can find love at any age. What do you mean, any age? Well, she's like two and a half years older than you. I think. <laughs> my life. Oh god. Something is different about my mom since this new girl showed up, and I don't know if I like it. She didn't want us to meet her yet, so I'm gonna head over and say hello. Uh, I'm bracing myself right now. 
Brandon, meet Natalie. Yeah, I'm her son. Is this the first time you've ever like dated a girl? No, I was with a girl years ago when they were little, but this is just happened Wait, what? to me. I didn't know that. No. <laughs> Can she get taste for a video? No, absolutely not.